That sound all right? Yeah. It sounded like I knew what I was talking about. Mando dope. Representing the cannabis culture. The planters of the trees. You want to grow them big trees. Get up the soil king. Yep, that's me. What's up, family? Soil King approved product right here. This is what the Soil King uses. These are my favorite top dress. This is called Mr. B's Green Trees. The basic of the fertilizer is a nutrition just like our body. We need substance to grow. The thing I like most about Mr. B's Green Trees is uh, these guys right here, man, they rep their stuff good and they know what they're doing. Their input ingredients are grade A organic. So um, they have 16, 17 different types of minerals and fertilizers. Bat guano, seabird guano, dolomite, neem meal, potash, oyster shell, feather meal, green sand, Whoa. volcanic ash, uh, glacier rock dust, and there's more in there as well. Plus it's packed with some mycorrhizae as well. It sounded like I knew what I was talking about. So we got 744. This one's your growth formula, and this one's your bloom formula. So they also have one that's a triple five, that's kind of a transition formula. You can use it as well, or you can kind of mix the two for a transition, works really well. The application, you know, it's easy. This is how I do it. This is how Soil King does it. Here's what it is. It's a dry fertilizer. So with that dry fertilizer, I like to go around my pots and I like to, what I call it, a heavy salt and pepper a steak, just like you would if you're barbecuing in the backyard. And uh, I just grab some of it. I go over to the big roots, of course, right? Get that big roots. And I just sprinkle it on, just like that. Bam, around your plant. And I do that through the veg. Through the beginning, I do it about every 10 days. And then when the plants get a little bit bigger, we start utilizing more of the fertilizer. I do it once a week. There it is. There's your application right there. And then you just, you can, if, you're, if your soil is more compacted, you can just scratch it in and it stays there. And then you water it once a week or every year, you know, soil schedule regimen is. That's the other good thing about the big roots. You see how it's nice and porous and light? So that when you hit it with water, it doesn't wash off. Kind of now it's in the soil, it mixes right in there. And then it's a time release. As you water it, it automatically, every time you water, it's gonna be releasing more fertilizers, bringing more value to your plant. Then you go into your bloom, and you do the same thing with the 286 when you go into with your flowers. And that, like a live center GT, is what you need right there. I mean, you're creating a living soil, any fertilizer, that the plant can't uptake of this, your, all your microbes and all your beneficials will break it down and make it available to the plant for nutrition and uptake. So, I mean, that's how the system works, how it's been working for billions of years. And uh, why change it? Because it works. That's organics right there, brother. Get that big roots.